Hi, everybody. It is January 23, 2019. Yes, today. Again, no sun. Completely blocked out. Cover to cover. Cloud substance manufactured by man. Once again, some psychopath decided we do not deserve any sun. And in reading your emails and comments, wow. Uh, just taking, you know, a few notes on comments. Arthritis really bad. So many of you are in physical pain. Teeth. Uh, suddenly having perfect teeth. Now they're brittle, breaking. Uh, Vomiting several times a week, diarrhea, hair loss, uh, hair breaking, hair dry. Um, many have said they've had incredibly thick hair, and now it's just falling out. Sinus infections, um, coughing up mucus, tickle in throat, can't get rid of it, no energy, angry, no days happy, headaches, migraines, leg cramps, uh, being stuck at work with Wi-Fi, swimming in Wi-Fi at work, can't get away from it all day long, drugged, spaced out, constant ringing in ears, debilitating fatigue, um, feels like brain is being compressed, uh, forced or induced loss of ambition, loss of interest, interest in socializing, um, having to struggle through that, relationships rupturing all over the place, uh, getting hostile and angry responses from people when you just simply try to inform them about, hmm, reality. Sick, can't get well. Wow. Well, you know, I think back on my first couple of years in YouTube, on YouTube, and now, Subscribers were still okay now. So many of you are so not okay. And yeah, it's very upsetting because all of this is being induced by sick, psychopathic, crazy nut jobs. They are determining how we are feeling. They're, they're already controlling every aspect of our life. Doesn't that piss you off? It pisses me off. Okay. Once again, I'm going to say, if you want to connect to people in your own area, leave me an email at neverlosetruth at gmail.com. In the subject heading, put your state where you live, and I will send it off to other people, your email address to other people in your state. Um, more and more people are doing it, and I'm hearing from more and more that it's actually um, a really good thing because they're able to connect to people, and I'm hearing good reports from those connections. And the other thing that I want to say before, before we go to, oh my God, what is this? Did somebody paint pretty much half of the country? Yeah, they did. World view. Uh, this is today. This uh, NASA's satellite image of today. Yeah, that's why we don't have any sun. All right. Um, I I just want to go through a couple of days of this satellite. If anybody knows of a room that is for rent in San Mateo County, South San Francisco, I have a subscriber who really needs to find a place to live. Her lease ends at the end of the month. And um, yeah, she's a little anxious to say the lease because it's only a week away. So if you know of anyone uh, who's renting a room, if you're renting a room, please email me at neverlosetruth at 
gmail.com and I will pass along that information to her. So yeah, they cut off our sun. This is not natural cloud. This is artificial, man-made, manufactured, and it's all over. Oh wow, that looks pretty scary. Uh, many people see the faces, yeah. Can you not see? Ah, oh, they're smiling down upon us. How sweet. Laughing at us. Crazy, sick people involved in this, man. Crazy, unbelievably sick, psychopathic people involved in this. I, there's no way that I could do it. No way. I could not poison the earth. Not for any amount of money could I do this. Unbelievable. Truly unbelievable. Anybody who thinks that this is natural cloud, you are out of your flipping mind. Out of your mind. All of this is the geoengineering, the, uh, the toxic chemicals and heavy metals that they are spraying to geoengineer, to transform, to terraform the earth. And they're quite successful at it. So, no, this is not natural at all and um well hmm ireland oh you get blasted often don't you yes you do scotland uh parts of london and france spain whoa you are getting really microwaved. No, sorry, not Mother Nature. I mean, it couldn't be more obvious. Could not be more obvious that man's hand is in this cloud right here, right? Yes, microwaves all over. Deadly microwaves all over. And you know what? Africa, the north half of Africa, they seem to be okay. Every time I go to the world view, Saudi Arabia and north, the north half of Africa seems to be pretty good. Um, and Australia, you don't seem to be but I've heard from so many of you that you do get plastered maybe it's just you know that one image that we get from NASA uh, that clearly is not telling the whole story so this was today unbelievable look at this tic-tac-toe look at this Jesus Really? You're going to tell me that that's natural? Oh, God. The Pacific. This gets into the oceans. It kills the ecosystem. Look at all these microwaves. Oh, man. Well, Again, I want to say I don't want anybody apologizing for leaving comments that you consider to be long, though I would love it if you would break it up in paragraphs um, because it's easier to read that way. But do not apologize for how you feel, okay? Don't. We've got to get out of that kind of thinking. We are being assaulted 
every which way with toxic chemicals, heavy metals. Our food doesn't, you know, sustain us, sustain health anymore. Uh, very hard um, to to find real organic, and an awful lot do not have the money anymore. So, you know, you. You're stuck with a lot of stuff that is also poisonous. Our water is poisonous. My God, our air is poisonous. The frequencies are so incredibly dangerous that the reason why I do these videos and ask you how are you feeling, because I want everybody to know, you guys, none of you are alone. So many people are having difficulty now with maintaining, even just feeling decent. And so many are afraid to say anything because they fear being judged. Well, I will tell you, any comment or response that I see in the comments section, anybody judging you or judging us or just, they're gone. They're gone. I don't, I'm, I'm, Done with all of that crap. Done with it. And what else is toxic? Holding in how you feel. And, you know, uh, marching on. That, too, has an effect on you. So, at least, you know, I will say, hey, get it out get it out here um, so please don't apologize at all and we do need to change we need to change so much of you know the American psyche the American attitude um, oh god you're so negative and oh she's such a complainer oh uh, you know, she's always on the dark side. Oh, she's this, she's that. You know what? I like real. Just give me real. That's it. Just give me real. Give me honest. Give me real. You know, what is the truth? I can absolutely handle. Fine. I don't have any problem with it at all. It's the lies and the pretense that I have a real big problem with. So, yeah, just today, we were pretty much, um, well, some of you in, in the mid uh, or central United States got some sun, maybe southern or all of California, I don't know, Arizona, New Mexico. But, yeah, we were blanketed here certainly you know the east coast uh, countries what was it like yesterday oh how sweet again no sun but they blocked out our sun so whatever time this image you know was captured and posted on world view this is not the this does not tell the whole story look at all of this Look at all of this. This how could anybody? How could NASA think that's natural? Really? Wow. Uh, you're talking serious frequencies that you're looking at right here. Serious frequencies. So does it matter where it is? You know, I. How many of you have left comments saying, we haven't had sun in two weeks. We hardly get any sun. We might get sun in, you know, for two hours, you know, um, every third day. They're blocking out the sun in so, in so many areas of this country. You guys up north, well, for years and years and years hardly had any sun. I mean, look at this. Well, it was, what, a haze? Oh my God. This is really unbelievable. 
Unbelievable. So, um, here we go. You can count on the Pacific, just the toxicities, the toxins. I mean, it's, and the frequencies. Look at this. I don't like the natural world being screwed with. I don't like the natural world being taken over. But it sure is, man. It sure is. So when you look at this, you know, uh, just scroll through, you know, go through each day. Um, you will see, even if we still had food and it had not been taken over, by genetically modified organisms, uh, even if we still had, you know, relatively clean water, uh, our air, the increasing um, aerosol spraying, it it's become so, it, but it's been going on for decades. So our air. Uh, you know, you need air. You need clean air to have, you know, good health. Well, we don't really have it. Look at North Africa, Saudi Arabia, and Australia. Hmm. Interesting. And of course, Europe bombarded bombarded what is the 21st like all oceans just now after years and years of this so um, where am I this is Africa this is Portugal Spain France um, it's hard to see, but yeah, Ireland, Scotland, England, Germany. <laughs> Unbelievable. So the 21st in good old America. I think we did have a day where there was sun. Wow, I can't even remember. Um, there was. But you know what? We never get that deep blue sky anymore. Never. Never. I can't stand this. I really can't stand this. Then you think about all of the you know, four-leggeds and all species, sick, dying, you know, we just hear from one another, you know, oh, the cats today have been zonked out, sleeping, 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 um, which is unusual. But again, we had, you know, that full coverage and they need to increase the frequencies and yeah, the cumulative, the cumulative effect of the frequencies is, um, well, it's taking its toll. Where am I? This was the 20th. Yep. Along the East Coast, no sun. This little patch. Look at all of the frequencies and look at all of the. Oh, man. And then we have just so many people who just don't care. No, Mother Nature does not operate in right angles. All right, guys, look, you know, I'll link below to Worldview and you can, you know, scroll on through.
all of the frequencies, all of the aerosols, toxic to all life. Obvious, very obvious, very obvious, not Mother Nature. So when you show this to somebody, and e any adult, any adult should see this and go, wow, that doesn't look natural. That doesn't look like a natural cloud. Okay, well, from there, you would think that in that mind, questions would be begged and they'd be like, okay, what is that? You just get people ignoring it. Okay, if you want to connect with anybody in your state, email me, neverlosetruth at gmail.com. If you know of a room for rent, San Mateo County, South San Francisco, email me, neverlosetruth at gmail.com. I'm sorry so many of you are feeling not quite right. Uh, you can bet I ain't quite right. I'm not someone who is like big on misery loves company, but first of all, I want to know to get a big picture of how how everybody is feeling in terms of all of these agendas, you know, and now I'm seeing, you know, just by reading your comments and knowing that these agendas have been ramped up, well, more and more of you are going to fall sick uh, more people are going to die, more pets are going to die, more sickness, more illness, and that means, you know, more financial hardship. No shit. This is no joke. We are at war. We are at war. And we can't seem to get through to people. Jesus. So we have to suffer the consequences. Yeah, that does piss me off. Now, I want to read you a comment, and then I'll leave you. Um, it was Laurie Berman, and it was great, and I really identify with it. Here, I don't know which feeling dominates me more, outrage at what is being done by the few, or utter frustration with the blind complacency of the many, hubris and murderous self-centeredness on the side of the controllers and their minions, and zombie-like, infantile self-centeredness on the side of their victims. Stuck in the middle. Don't know who to get angry at? Well, I do. I get angry at the American people because these sick, psychopathic few, oh, they are just evil to the core. You cannot ever think you're going to change that evil. The only hope you have is to change your fellow Americans. Try to get through to them, you know, and uh, hope that they grow up and act responsibly, you know, and, and hope that they care that life on this planet is dying. But when you see the lack of care, when you see this self-centeredness oozing out every single day, yeah, yeah, that infuriates me far more than these sick psychopathic nutjobs. Psychopaths, all they know is, hey, let's destroy life. And good people, good people create and they want to. They want to protect life and they want to enhance life. So we have a few really evil people destroying life. And then all of their minions who think that they're good people when in fact they're not. And then you got a few good who want to protect life, enhance life. And then the majority, you know, in the middle are just, oh, just going about their life and thinking that they're good when they're not. They're not. You know, they're just too busy with, oh, idolizing themselves and just 
pursuing their own comfort. And that's why things have really ramped up to a point where we don't get sun anymore. We hardly get sun anymore. I really like sun. All right, guys. Have a good